What is going on, guys? I am Pat the Pac-Man. I am joined here by my little baby, Sophie. Look at the little Sophster. She's so cute. She's actually staying here with me uh, for a week. Her mommy's away on vacation, so she left her here with me to uh, to hang out and to keep me company, and I'm keeping her company. So look at that little face. Look how cute. She's a little squirmy, but she's so cute. So I was actually doing some work on my, on my desk over here while I'm hanging out with Sophie, so I decided to shoot a little video uh, about something that I call focusing on progress, not perfection. Focus on progress, not perfection. I tell my clients this all the time. I beat it into their heads. I should, I, I should like tattoo it on my forehead right over here. Why do I say focus on progress, not perfection? It's because we're all, we all desire perfection. Everything has to be perfect and it all has to be done fast. Well, here's the thing. Perfection doesn't exist. What the goal should be is to strive for perfection. That will keep us motivated to continue to do the same things, to continue to do the right things. So focusing on progress in moving in the right direction. So for example, when I'm working with a dog to try to rehabilitate a behavior or to train a behavior or to teach a behavior or to whatever it is, then I always tell my clients, if your dog used to behave in a certain way, let's say barking out the window, and your dog used to bark out the window at level 10, but now you're barking, your dog is barking out the window at level nine, that's progress. Is it good? Is it perfect? Of course not. Are we, gonna, are we done? Of course not. But it's progress. That keeps us motivated. That means we're doing the right thing. That means we're going in the right direction. So perfection does not exist. And so if we focus on perfection, we will be disappointed every single time. And that's the problem. That's what a lot of my clients fall into the trap of. Well, you know, it's going okay, but it's still not perfect. Well, it's not supposed to be. It's never going to be perfect. You know what I mean? If you, you have to understand that your attitude plays a role. So when you are focusing on the progress, your dog has a good attitude about it, right? Your dog understands that he or she, in this case, she, the little cutie pants, is doing the right things. You know what I mean? So it's almost like a child that brings home, brings home Fs all the time, and now all of a sudden they're starting to bring home D minuses, is it good? No, but we're going in the right direction as long as we continue to progress, right? So the other thing that ends up happening is, and I see this happening quite often, is the fact that, that when people expect perfection or they see some kind of progress, they stop doing the things that got them that progress in the first place because in their minds, they're thinking, well, we're going in the right direction so I can hang back and not worry about it anymore. That's not true because the stuff that you are doing is what's getting you the progress. If you, I know Sophie, if you, if you stop doing the stuff that got you that progress, you know what's gonna happen? You're gonna revert back to the old behaviors. So everything goes out the door. All that progress is gone. So you wanna continue to move forward. You want to continue to progress and to, and to improve and get better, understanding that the objective is to achieve that perfection. And you need to continue to work to get to that perfection, right? That's your goal. So focus on progress, not perfection. In life, not just with dogs. Catch you next time.